ready to make a Halloween themed peekaboo shirt? I know I am. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, where have you been? Oh, are you over on TikTok? It is all over TikTok where we're going to be making this trending TikTok Halloween themed peekaboo shirt. So if that sounds like something you may be interested in, stay tuned. If this sounds like something that may add value to your business, hit the like button. And while you're there, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Now, why do I need to hit the subscribe button? Is that what you're asking? Let me tell you why. My mission for coming to YouTube is to be able to share my journey as I grow my small business in hopes of it helping you grow your small business as well. So if that sounds like something that would actually work for you and your business, please be sure to hit that subscribe button. And while you're there, be sure to turn on your post notifications so that you'll be notified each time I drop a new video. So without further ado, let's get into it. You're gonna need the following items. I've already laid out my fabric, the polyester. This is 100% polyester. I will have this link below in the description box. But I've taken my print, I've laid it on the fabric. So I've marked it, now we're gonna cut and get started. Okay, we've sublimated our design onto the 100% polyester fabric, which, oh, can we talk about these? I mean, like, would you look at how vivid that color is? Wait, look at Beetlejuice. Look, look at Beetlejuice. Like, should I say his name three times? I'm just saying. So now we're going to get to the portion of the video where we are going to be cutting the shirt to create the peekaboo effect. So stay tuned for that. Now, these are shirts that I already had. I didn't go out and buy anything special. I just happened to have these shirts on hand. So I chose this black one here, which is just a Gildan. And then I also have an orange shirt. So I'm thinking orange is gonna be Freddy Krueger. I don't know. That's what, that's what I'm thinking. And I'm thinking Beetlejuice will be the actual black shirt. So let's get to cutting. Okay, really quickly, I just wanted to come in and talk about what is actually going on in this particular clip. So, as you can see, I've laid the, the sublimated piece of polyester down, and at this point, I am measuring out my heat and bond iron-on adhesive. Okay, so that's what you're watching now. Now, the picture to the right with the orange shirt, I'm showing you what it looks like once you peel the backing off. After you've done your first heat press and peeled the backing off, that's what it looks like. But once I get all of those pieces aligned on the Beetlejuice shirt, I am then going to press with the backing facing up, as you can see. I'm gonna press that for about two seconds. Once that's done, you let it cool and then you peel the backing off of all of the pieces of adhesive, iron-on adhesive. Then you place the sublimated piece of polyester fabric down, face down, and then you press again for about eight to 10 seconds and it's completely adhered. But I just wanted to come in and explain what was going on in this clip. Now back to the video. Hey you guys. Are you ready for the final reveal? Here we go. <laughs> oh my God, that is so cute. Look at that. Oh my gosh, this is actually really, 
really fun to make. So that was Beetlejuice. Now this is Mr. Croup. Are you ready? Ah! <laughs> How cute is that? That is so stinking cute. I had so much fun with these. Like, it's a fun tea to make. I mean, how could you really get mad? Like, these are classics. Like, Beetlejuice and Freddy Krueger? Really? Nightmare on Elm Street? What? <laughs> so I thought it was a lot of fun. I wanted to make them, and so I wanted to do it with you all. Hopefully, you enjoy being able to make this TikTok Halloween peekaboo shirt with me. And if you did, please make sure that you hit that like button. If you feel like this video in any way, shape, or form added value, and don't forget to subscribe. And most importantly, not only subscribe, but make sure you hit the notification bell so that you'll be notified each time I post a new video. And until next time, bye.